We provide services for children and adults uh, all over the country who have hearing and vision impairment, so dual sensory impairment or deaf blindness. Um, the project uh, that you see here uh, is a result of uh, having time during COVID to um, create, but it's always something I've wanted to do in the, all of the schools that I, I go to. I realize that uh, the children don't have the same uh, number of choices uh, for books as typical children who may go into the library and have hundreds of books to choose from. Uh, so I really wanted to sort of link in um, people like uh, students in TY groups who may have um, the time, the energy, uh, the capability to provide the teachers who don't have that same time to create resources for their students. Um, so it was just a, a result of that. And um, the schools today, they're the first schools to go through this um, project fully. And I think it's, it's a testament to uh, the, you know, the dedication of the teachers and the students, but also it's uh, gonna show you know, future schools who partake in this project, uh, what can happen if you link, you know, link uh, resources within the community. Transition year students from our school where I did the literacy project here for St. Theresa's National School. We did the project as a sensory project for the kids and we made them into books and we transcribed them. Um, when we were doing the sensory project we've all felt like it was a great opportunity to do and it felt like we were giving back to the community we were involved in. We would like to thank the staff of St. Theresa's and um, Miss Cusack for letting us do this opportunity. It was also a great privilege to see the different aspects and of doing this project and it was also really enjoyable to know that this would help so much kids and in their, in their education and we also re all really enjoy doing this. Thank you. Hello. Um, we were delighted to be asked uh, to take part in this project. Um, we wanted to uh, give something back to the community. We have a great group of TY girls this year and um, we wanted to uh, be involved in the literacy project. Some of them are very creative and they wanted to uh, produce the books and help out uh, the girls at St. Teresa's. The school would like to thank uh, Deirdre Leach and also the staff here, um, Anita at St. Teresa's, for giving the girls the opportunity. Um, it was a great partnership, I think, and hopefully it's a project that can continue in the future. And I hope that future TYs will also have uh, the possibility to take part with this. Excited 